Hi, I'm Leanne Pilkington, Managing Director of Lang & Simmons. When you're selling your property, you want the best real estate agent for the job. And quite often I get asked, how do I find the best agent? So here's my top three tips to help you find the best real estate agent to sell your property. Now, if you're like most people, you don't sell your property very often, which means it's easy to miss important details. Details that could cost you money. Unfortunately, there are agents out there who rely on your potential inexperience. They'll try to gloss things over and they'll tell you what they think you want to hear. Anything in order to secure a listing agreement from you. So here's my first tip. Ensure your agent is a great communicator. The best agents are excellent communicators and will answer all of your questions. In fact, they'll answer questions you haven't even thought of asking. The best agents understand that selling your home can be a bit overwhelming. Whilst this might be the first time you've sold a house or the first time in a long while, the best agents have done this hundreds of times before, so they know exactly how to best help you through this process. Lack of communication can be one of the biggest frustrations when selling a house. It's stressful enough without you having to chase up your agent all the time. Each area is different. In fact, suburbs right next to each other or even areas within a suburb can be miles apart when it comes to things like desirability, target market and price points. The old saying, knowledge is power, goes double for real estate. Knowing how to maximise the value of your home requires extensive local knowledge. So my second tip is the best agent will know your area in detail. Now I'm not just talking about knowing your suburb. Big picture knowledge is really important, in fact it's vital. But the best agents know the details about the specifics. They know what's happening at a neighbourhood level, even down to individual properties. The best agents understand their community. They've been in an area long enough to understand the property drivers and what motivates people not just to buy in your area, but what motivates them to pay the maximum market value for your home. The best agents will be able to make solid, knowledgeable suggestions regarding things you can do to maximise your property's value. They'll be able to give you real life examples and provide you with results achieved from selling homes similar to yours. But by far, the single most important factor to consider before you decide who the best agent is to sell your property, and this is my tip number three, feedback from previous clients. Now I'd like to point out that whilst testimonials on websites are great, in reality they can be written by anyone. Now I'm not saying that none of these are genuine, far from it. But what you really need is independent, verifiable, honest feedback on social media. And the best place to get that is review sites. Have a look at how many stars an agent has on Google, Yelp or Yellow Pages. These can quite often provide an accurate indication of feedback. Let's face it, no one's going to publish a negative testimonial on their website or introduce you to an unhappy ex-client. But with Google, you can find honest feedback from real clients. The best agents don't just welcome verifiable feedback, they encourage it because they know their clients are freely going to leave great feedback. So there are my top tips for when you're looking to sell your property with the real estate agent who's best for you. If you'd like my complete list of tips, just click on the link and download them for free. I'm Leanne Pilkington, Managing Director of Lang & Simmons. Thanks for joining me.